Hi guys, hope you guys are having a great day today. I am going to make a chicken soup for this cold weather. So, um, and I'm gonna kind of vlog a little bit, show you guys what I've been up to lately. So I have the chicken thighs already boiling and I have zucchinis, carrots, potatoes, and um, what is it, celery. You can really put any kind of vegetable you want in a chicken soup, it's just really, um, whatever you, whatever vegetable you like. So I like to just put the thighs in here and I put two tablespoons of chicken broth to give it a little flavor and I let it boil till the chicken is not falling apart, not done, but just, um, just slightly cooked. And then I like to just kind of skim all this off right here. So I put six chicken thighs and I'm gonna let it cook for about 30 minutes and then I'm going to add the vegetables and cook it until it is, till actually just until they're, the vegetables are done. But you don't wanna overcook the vegetables cause then they start falling apart in here. Um, yeah, this chicken soup is super balmy. And especially for this cold weather, oh my gosh, it's so good. But I like to add, um, I add the, the chicken broth that I always use here, so. Oh, and then I'm gonna add cabbage. So I went to Michael's today and I bought these ornaments here. And I bought the ornaments for that tree that is just sitting there screaming for help. But let me show you what else. I the, the stuff that was 60%, aren't these cute? I bought these last year at Michael's too. I love Michael's. But this is what I got today. Let me show you. I bought these little cute um, gingerbread ornaments. A little gingerbread house. Aren't they, aren't they cute? So I got five of those. And then I got um, the gingerbread. And these were, how much were they? They were $5, but these were 60% off, so. So let me see, I got three, four, five. So I got five gingerbread ornaments and five of the little houses. These are so, so cute. And then I got these. These were $2 and these were 60% off, so pretty cool. Um, I'm gonna show you how I decorated my tree with these. If your tree is bald, you can use these and it makes it so pretty, but I'll show you a little bit. So I got these. But I wanted to share something with you guys really quick. Have you guys ever bought these? They are so cool. Scented cycle. Cycle? I don't know what it is. Scented ornaments. You put them in your tree. I'm going to show you what I do with them. But this little styrofoam I bought to put in the hat here. You know, I made this hat a couple of years ago. Pretty cute. Frosty the Snowman's hat. So um, I put the styrofoam in here and then I put a bunch of, what do you call it? Um, green greenery to make it look really pretty. And I put a little bird in it and stuff. So. Let me check the soup really quick. Oh yeah, see you don't want it to do that. Oh Lord mercy, drop that. So I'm going to put it on, on this music. Okay, no Miss Sally yet right now. Okay, let's just put it on low. So, so I'm gonna continue to boil the chicken. Okay. okay. I've been wanting to decorate the backyard for quite some time but it seems every weekend it's raining. So that's gonna be one of my goals this week is open those boxes and start decorating the backyard. The reason I don't put decorations in the front, no lights, no nothing is because I don't know what it is. People around here just take stuff. So, but look how cute this little um, rosemary Christmas tree. I bought it at Home Depot. That thing was only $5. It was normally 10 and I got it for five. So you know what this is? I am going to make beef jerky. Yes. So I put lights in the tree, but I didn't put any. There you go. So it looks cute, huh? So those are the ornaments that I was telling you that I'll put all around it and just fill that up. 
Soup is looking good. Weather is looking ugly. So it's the little sticks here. You grab one. You grab the little hooks that come with it. How many come in here? Let me see. Six. So you get six of these and six little hooks. I'm gonna put the hook in there, drag it down on the bottom and you hang it like this, you see? And then you can go and put it in your tree. You just hang it anywhere, right here. You can hang it right here, see? You can't see it because it's green and the tree is green, but you can literally smell the pine. It's, it's fabulous. So I'm gonna put about, so if six come in one can, I'm gonna put three here and then I'm going to, let me show you where else you can put them to. Um, the smell is really pretty. It's not too piney, so that's kind of cool. But look, I'm going to put um, some on the chimney. I'm going to finish the ch chicken soup. And then I'm going to start decorating the Christmas tree that is screaming help. To Michael's today, they didn't have um, the mesh. And usually I put like mesh around there. So I'm going to kind of go to my Christmas... Um, storage and see what I can pull out and um, just kind of be creative because I got the stairs, this tree and the chimney and I want to do the recipe. I want to do a, a recipe for the beef jerky because oh my gosh, the beef, oh my gosh, did you see my hair? You know, I was in the street all day today and it was raining so that tells you a lot. But anyways, so let's go check out and see if the chicken, chicken soup is done. I'm going to add the zucchinis, carrots, whatever vegetable you would like to add. But um, this is what I'm going to kind of... I love vegetables. There you go. And now you're going to cook it for 20 minutes until the vegetables are a little bit soft but not falling apart. Remember the chicken is already cooked, so you just want it to get all the juices of the flavor of the vegetables, the flavor of the chicken broth into it. So let me show you how how this rain is out here in Cali. Look. Oh Lord. Super cold out there. My tree is still hollering help. Got all these decorations to put. Want to make a video on beef jerky. Um, I've been making it for years and I put it in these cute little baggies and I give them out as gifts and people rave about it. But I'm going to hopefully try to do the video today on beef jerky and, um, yeah, get these ornaments up and I'm still making the chicken soup. We got the vegetables inside of there. We are done. Let's go decorate the tree. If I don't finish it today, I'm not going to finish it. So I need to get all these ornaments that I bought from Michael and get this tree done today. This is when I wish Connor and Zachary were here to help Nana put all these ornaments on the tree. Remember I told you guys about these pines, these sticks little here, these um, makes your tree smell really pretty. So the chicken is now done. The vegetables are perfect, they're not falling apart, and the chicken is super tender.